Welcome to the Joy of Music. Featuring the First Lady of the Organ, Diane Bitch. We invite you to meet great composers and performers. Travel to Europe's ancient monasteries and snow-covered Alps. Visit great historical cathedrals and beautiful lakes and gardens. Praise ye the Lord. Praise Him with stringed instruments and organs. Praise Him with a psaltery and harp. Praise Him with a trumpet. Let everything that hath breath praise the Lord. And now, Miss Diane Bish. Welcome to the Joy of Music. Today we bring you a special program featuring the music of the famous composer Felix Mendelssohn. Mendelssohn lived from the year 1809 to 1847. One of the most gifted of all composers, he was also an outstanding pianist, conductor, and organist. We begin the program today by playing one of his organ sonatas, God's Will Be Done All Way. We hear the last movement as played on the great organ of the St. Florian Monastery in St. Florian, Austria. Mendelssohn's Reformation Symphony was inspired by Martin Luther and the hymn, A Mighty Fortress. It is in the last movement of this symphony that we hear the hymn, A Mighty Fortress. However, on today's program, we hear the second movement, which is full of great joy, yet elegant in style. Thank you. 
As well as being gifted on the piano and organ, Mendelssohn was more than an adequate performer on the viola and violin. It is the Mendelssohn Violin Concerto in E minor that is one of his greatest works and one of the finest concertos of violin repertoire. We hear now the second movement of this concerto with its most simple but exquisitely beautiful melody. We return to the St. Florian Monastery in Austria to hear the second movement of this work performed by Joy Brown Wiener, the outstanding concertmaster of the Memphis Symphony.
Mendelssohn was a composer inspired by scripture. He had come to a personal relationship with Jesus Christ through his study of Johann Sebastian Bach's St. Matthew Passion and also the life and witness of Martin Luther. Probably Mendelssohn's most famous organ work is his Sonata No. 6, the Sonata on the Lord's Prayer. Although we do not have time to play the entire work on today's program, I would like to play the section which describes the words of the Lord's Prayer. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. This is played on the great organ of the St. Bavo Cathedral in Harlem, Holland. Mendelssohn's sensitive spirit and style can be heard in his short but reverent nocturne. 
Its harmony and beautiful melodies breathe into the listener a feeling of peace and serenity. Today on The Joy of Music, we have presented the music of Felix Mendelssohn. It was Mendelssohn himself who often said, The Bible is the best of all, for in it are the words of life, the words of Jesus Christ. It is still true today. The Bible is the best of all, for in it and through it we find abundant life and life eternal. Thank you so much for joining us on The Joy of Music, and we look forward to seeing you again next week. Thank you for joining us today on The Joy of Music. Diane Bisch and The Joy of Music wish to thank Lufthansa German Airlines for their support in making this program possible. <laughs>